Tonight on Designer to the Stars, Kristen Bell, star of Veronica Mars, wants a backyard overhaul. I hope that Carrie can help me find a working relationship with my backyard and my dogs. I love doing outdoor doggy areas. Outdoor doggy areas are the best. I'm trying to find homes for lots of unwanted doggies. I love you. And we're going to get you a perfect home now. Don't you worry about that. Don't you worry about that, Ella. And I have got a surprise workout for my assistants. Sam's down here basically dying. <laughs> I'm Carrie Whitman. My life's a little bit crazy. I'm completely nuts. Can you take your shirt off and stand against the wall? I've been an actress. I've dated celebrities. What was I thinking? I am so over it. Now, I'm an interior designer. Most of my clients are famous. I didn't plan it that way. It just kind of worked that way. I'm definitely very difficult to work for sometimes. I don't know what the hell he's talking. He's full of shit. I've been engaged one, two, three times. <laughs> Dogs are a huge passion of mine. So I started a dog rescue foundation. It's all a little bit crazy. I am an interior designer and a dog rescuer. My life is nuts, and I wouldn't have it any other way. Today, I'm shopping for my new client, Kristen Bell. She's the hot young TV star who plays Veronica Mars. Wow, you guys got a lot of new stuff, huh? Yeah, we just got a new shipment. I'm shopping here today to find some stuff for Kristen Bell. Well? Outdoor stuff, mostly. Big pots, um, some really cool stuff. Uh, yeah, can I take a couple pieces to show uh, Kristen? The bathtub. It's for a bathtub for just a dog. Outside bathtub with hot and cold running water. I need this in red, blue, and yellow. I, I do know. have that. Yes, I do. That's kind of cool. Just Those are all made in Morocco? Yep. Are you made in Morocco, too? Yes, I was. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Can we get that other piece that's beautiful? That, I think, uh, would look nice with the burgundy. See, there's a piece of burgundy right here. This is what I want. You can give me a broken one. I don't care. So in case I break it, then you're not going to be mad at me because it was already broken. No, I won't get mad at you for I don't want you to make that. me camel meat or something like that. Oh, <laughs> Those beautiful humps on their back. Oh, oh, I just want to love vegetables. that little lover dove. Are you sure you don't eat any camel? No, I haven't. I don't know if I can buy from you if you're eating camel, you know. <laughs> You have all the fountains over here, right? I wanted to do some kind of crazy fountain. Like, that's a beautiful one. Oh, I love the red one over there. That one's beautiful. It's got a bunch of dead fish in it or something. Does the water come with it, or I have to pay extra for that? No, no, there's a dead fish there. That's uh, all you can eat. All you can eat, dead yeah. fish? Okay, so this is Kristen Bell's house from Veronica Mars. She wants to do an outdoor area for her and her dogs. Hi. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. We're so excited to come to your place. I know. Awesome. We're going to make a doggy outdoor paradise and a Kristen outdoor paradise. I hope that Carrie can help me um, find a working relationship with my backyard and my dogs so that all three of us can be very uh, symbiotic. So this is it. This is cool. You got a ton of stuff we can do back here. Oh, you have this whole outdoor area. Cool. Which I love, but the problem is the furniture um, doesn't fit. I'd really like to make this into a very welcoming, comfortable place that's a little more full than what it is, because it seems so sparse right now. I'd say I'm pretty eclectic. I like um, a lot of modern stuff, but I like a lot of traditional. I like a lot of vintage. I like things that aren't just one style. Okay, and then as far as furniture goes, do you like, like, teak? Do you like ba uh, bamboo? Do you like wicker? I mean, I can give you a bunch to choose from, but... I like teak. I like bamboo. I also love the wrought iron look. Okay. I don't mind mixing them at all. Positive, we can do it. I'm gonna see what we can do as far as the plumbing and everything. But doing like an outdoor hot and cold running doggy bathtub, oh, so you could wash wash them out here yeah. and have it made out of tile. So I brought a bunch of really cool tiles. I really like this one. I like that one a lot. And too. I love the blue. And I like the black. It comes in black also. Ooh, I, I knew you would like the black. That one's beautiful. She presents so many options because I think she's really 
um, committed to giving me what I want. These three are your favorite? Yeah. This one, this one, and this one? Yeah. This also you can mix with burgundy. Ooh, that one's definitely and red and bright and fun. Yeah. And we can use both. Wanna do that? Yeah. Cool. All right. Right? What do you think about it? You are a really goofy looking thing with your bloomers on. <laughs> are you in heat? You got your bloomers on? You got I bet she's driving all the other little boys in town crazy. She, oh my gosh. <laughs> she's driving the girls crazy too. She's I just bet. because her her hormone level is so high, she's so rambunctious. Yeah. But the deal with the pants on the dog is she's a very smart owner. Is when dogs go into heat, it's like their little protection. So I think that if we put the doggy door over here, and then I'll probably do some really cool painting around the doggy door. Oh. It would look cool to go inside. Yeah. Okay, so we'll do the doggy door here. We'll do this whole outdoor paradise for dogs and for you. That would be <laughs> wonderful. We're gonna make it happen. You're gonna be happy. So thanks. I'm glad I'm doing that. I'm glad I'm doing it. Work with you and for you. I know, and I'm so happy you love them because you know you yes, you're gonna spoil end up them. with two more. <laughs> Just kidding. Right. I probably will. I We're probably gonna get will. you a home, and then she's gonna foster another one, so I can right. save another life. How do you right. feel about that? She's like, I'm wearing panties. So I'm going to take Kristen's drab backyard and turn it into an oasis for her and her dogs. I'm going to make the deck area more fun with some new furniture and cool accessories. I'm going to create a hot and cold running dog bath with some beautiful Moroccan tile. And I'm putting in a custom doggy door that features portraits of Kristen's own dogs. This is Warren calling with Ace of Hearts Dog Rescue. I think I spoke with you yesterday. Hey, you guys. I have a special treat for all of you. You guys, I asked you to bring comfy clothes for a reason. Yeah. We have someone down there that wants to share a little. All work and no play makes for a very dull staff. Carrie, I'm nervous, frankly. <laughs> I don't know what that means. You guys get in your outfits. Don't walk in on each other, because Sam's already walked in on me, and we don't want to do that again. So. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Stephen Vincent is a yoga instructor. Oh. oh. So you guys were gonna do some in-house yoga. Have you guys practiced any yoga at all before ever? Yoga? Yeah. No. Okay. No. <laughs> Have all of you do something to keep yourselves in shape or any kind of cardio or gym work? Or you Sam's not answering. Some extent. <laughs> okay. It's a minimal extent, you know. Okay. Twice a year, I try not to eat fried chicken. I don't know. <laughs> Would you come and come and stand more or less in the middle of the mat? Uh, settle in. Feel the soles of the feet on the on the mat on the floor. Take an inhale as you sweep the hands up overhead. Exhale. Tilt to the right. Tilt to the left. Reach the chest forward. Float the hands down. Knuckles closest to the wrist and press the pads of the thumbs and the knuckles to the floor. Bend the knees. Sam, you're doing good. I know you are down there, Sam. I can feel it. Oh, duh. <laughs> Sam, what are you doing? <laughs> Sam's down there basically dying. <laughs> what do you get for walking on on me naked? I'm getting my revenge. <laughs> I want you to switch positions with Warren. I gotta keep an eye on you. Warren, switch positions with Sam. Come here, Sam. Sam has his ski pants on. <laughs> <laughs> Is that me? Reach out, reach out, way up. Push the body up, inhale back into a crescent. Good job, Sam. You sweating yet? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. You okay, Sam? I feel like you're gonna hide the ventilator over there. I'm the only one who's sweating, like, terribly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're gonna end with just a little chant. So. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm not picking the chanting. Sorry, it's okay. It's okay. You, then you can just listen. You can listen, okay. exactly. You, know, you can Good. absorb the vibes with everybody else. So we'll just do Om, basically. It's the simplest mantra. And uh, we'll chant along together with this instrument known as a singing bowl.
that an application online? Yeah. Okay. So why don't you guys take her out and sit with her over here? I tell my clients that Saturday between 11 and 5, I'm just not available. So I have to put my time at that point into the dogs. Hi, Popeye. Hi, Toby. Hi, Dottie. I don't have time for cats. I like cats. I have no problems with cats. I just don't have time for cats. I s There's 40 dogs here. Ella just got returned today, and I'm pissed off about it. Hi, Ella. And we're depressed. Yeah. She's depressed because the f is giving her yeah, back. Brought her back. She's she crying in her cage when he walked away. It's okay, sweetie love. We're gonna get you a good spot. Yes, we are. We're gonna get you a perfect home now. Don't you worry about that. Don't you worry about that, Ella. Everything's gonna be beautiful. They had her for about seven months, and they're returning her. They said she. They just can't handle her. I've got to find a new home for this beautiful dog. Basically, we have applications on some dogs. Look at, they're looking at her. She's a very, very sweet dog. Just depends on now, after the house checks and after we're done, to make sure that we think it's a good home for the dog. Let me just ask you some questions. What are your work hours? They're very flexible. I work five to midnight. OK, so you're home all day. House or apartment? It's a house. And then with the dog food predominantly indoor or outdoor? Indoor. And where did she sleep at night? In my bed. Awesome. In my bed or in yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's how I am. Yeah. What kind of exercise do you give dogs? We go about two miles every day. Two miles? Okay. And um, we go to Reggie Canyon every day. Oh, you're awesome. Okay, let's fill it out. Well, uh... You like her. Yeah. She's pretty great, yeah. isn't she? She's really special dog. Like really special dog. I mean, look how look how regal she's she so, is. Yeah. You're beautiful, Ella. She knows it, I think. <laughs> look at her. Little vein. You're beautiful, Ella. Do you want to do a trial with her? Yeah, I would like to. I will call you tomorrow or Monday morning when someone will come over and check it, and then you can just foster to adopt. Right. Does that sound good for yeah, you? That's great. Carrie's always late, yeah. I don't, I don't know if she's ever been on time for me, so. That's all right. I, what I'm surprised is she's not barreling down the road. Hey, Johnny. What's happening? Good to see you. Good to see you. Sorry, I'm a few minutes late. <laughs> That's all right. Part of the course? Yeah, sure. This is Kristen Bell's house. She's on the show Veronica Mars. Yeah, right on. I want to make an entire, like, doggy paradise, which right is on. also conducive to her wanting to have her own little paradise. Kristen, like Carrie and myself, we're all dog lovers. And that's really the common theme. And that's going to be exciting. We have to do a massive doggy door over here. OK. I want to do some really cool Asian pebbles around here cool. also. Yeah. Stones that come through here that are, you know, checkerboard yeah. with the grass in between. You know, not the flagstone, maybe something a little more manicured looking. OK. I think that she's got the hot tub here. I think we should do the bathtub, you know, so, like in the middle. OK. With stairs that go up to it. There. You want to put stairs up into the hot tub? Into the, no, into the bathtub. Into the bathtub. The doggy bathtub. Yeah. We just got to figure out how we're going to get hot and cool running water and the drain. We're going to build this pretty extravagant outdoor bathtub that everyone's going to want to go home and figure out how can I have Kristen's bathtub for my dogs. I know I've got a couple dogs that are going to line up and go, OK, when do we get ours? Maybe on the back wall with all the tile, we'll put like, you know, maybe we can find some like doggy heads that water comes out of their mouth or something yeah. like that, you know? So all this has to be done in two weeks. Two weeks from now. Now. Sweet. It's probably a two month project, and we get two weeks. And Carrie is going to make it feel like a two month project, but we'll get it done. So I need you to do the doggy door. Sure. I need you to do the bathtub. And I need you to do the outdoor living area. Wait, hold on a second. Hey, is everything good? But Carrie is, you know, she's always on a phone. The flags, uh huh, maybe a little rosemary, the feather grass. Yeah. Sorry, we're right Hey, is everything okay? Mm -hmm. Give me one second, I'm going to call you right back. Hold on a second. Hi, this is Carrie. Yes, Sam. You know, I would love to be this her cell carrier, basically, because uh, I know her. You know, I don't even know what that bill is. Okay, give me what? Just give me one second. I'm like, I'm doing this thing right now. I'll call you right back. Okay, 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 bye. Yeah, what's up? So I gotta go to the place where I buy all of my kind of more heavy stone and slate, um, so I can. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Talk to me. For 
Please refer to the map. Oh, thanks. I can't do that by myself. Oh my god. This f thing. I don't even. I'm gonna. Can you call my my guy Nels that I bought the car from this, right? and tell him that this that the guy will not talk to me. The guy in the car will not talk to me. That whatever the guy who tells me where to go. I'm going to get some big pieces of slate that will go around the perimeter of Kristen Bell's backyard because I want to have a place where the dogs can chase the squirrels around and not hurt the grass. How are you, sweetie? Good, thank you. Well, you're, you're showing them what's amazing. I need something for outdoors. I need uh, either 24 by 24s or preferably 12, uh, 24 by 10s. This is the Burma tape. The one you have your hands on is a totally different part. Just hold on one second. Sure. Hi, what's up? Can what? I have a piece of this too? Mm -hmm. And then can you quote me the three? Sorry, one second. So the Hi, Julie. That's good. This yeah. one. That one's good. Hi, this is Carrie. What's that blue? That blue is really cool. Is that new? It's a porcelain. Oh, that's porcelain, huh? Yeah. Thank you, babe. Did you get a dog yet? No. You want I a dog yet? I don't have time right now. You don't have time. Plus, you want your dog to sleep outside. You can't have a dog for me. Yeah, yeah. We don't allow dogs to sleep outside. Yeah, I can't. Sorry, buddy. Bell's house because I'm going to meet with my contractor because we're going to frame the big dog bath that I'm making for her and um, also my wonderful painter Verdell. Hey guys, how are you doing? Good. What's going on? Hey Verdell, look at you in your little sun hat. It's very cute. So Johnny, have they started framing it all yet? Or yeah, anything? and be careful. We've dug a trench. We started excavating the other day and now we're building the frame for the tub. Okay, so this is the this is the doggy pool, huh? This is what we yeah. talked about as far as size. Yep. Yeah. Hmm. So we're at like, like only at 30 inches? Uh, for the wall, it's not big enough. No? Mm -mm. No, it's got to be, it's got to, I want it bigger. It's not big enough. No? No, I don't. This is exactly what we talked about the other night. I know, but I'm looking at it now, so. I knew she would change her mind today. I knew it. We came out today. It's too small. It's too small. You got to pull it out. I, mean, I want the bath mm -hmm. to like be almost this big when it's done. Okay. And sorry, but it's just no, maybe okay. there was misunderstanding. Maybe seeing it, I see it. I I want it to be where she can put three or four dogs in there. You know okay. what I mean? Yeah. I think it would be cool. The steps are as big as the tub, and then when it goes up, the, the tub has a wall. So there's a skinny one in the middle. Do you know what I'm saying? skinny one in the middle. Do you see what I'm saying? That's the size of the step. I don't think we work well on design sometimes. I don't think we really understand each other and we need to figure this out. And that is that. Carrie's tough like that, but she she sees it. You know, she sees it better than anyone. Okay, the steps go the length of the tub yep. up to where the, the last riser is, okay? Yep. Right. So the last riser is gonna go higher and then in the middle, I'm gonna cut a section out where the dogs will go in and out. Oh, okay. I don't want this, I don't want the entrance to the tub as wide as these steps. Okay. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. Now I think we finally have our stick in the mud for good. And uh, we'll keep framing, then we'll probably pour the concrete uh, in a, a day or two. Over here, we're doing the doggy door. Now, Johnny? Yes. So with this doggy door, didn't we decide the doggy door was gonna go more in the corner? Yeah. So the doggy door here, so this is for the, the doggy door entrance decoration. It's a big piece of plywood that we're going to paint. Riddell's going to paint some dog heads on it with some bones and be super creative and make it look beautiful. Remember, her walls are a little peachy here. So do you want to match it with a little darker than the wall itself? Darker with a little more gold, a little more yellow in it. Okay. You know what I mean? Maybe we can glaze over it with the yellow. But maybe inside of the dogs, somewhere, there's some kind of color of the wall. Just pull the wall in a little bit. Oh. And we have wall makeup, so we can mix all this together. OK. okay. <laughs> Why don't we try to mix a color that's like the wall, but maybe like a little darker than the wall? I would say maybe a little butter, a little topaz. I think we need like a drop of like yeah. red in there. See, the red works good. A drop of clay? Yeah. I think you need some yellow. 
not too bad because the base kind of works. Let me see. Um, yeah, it's darker. It's it works. I like it. So we have this beautiful dog named Ella that was at my adoption event, and she is a doll baby. So someone took her home on a trial. And I'm going to go over there right now to take a look and make sure that she's happy. And if everything looks good and she looks well fed and she looks happy and her tail's wagging and her eyes are bright, then she's found a new home and I've saved another life. I hear a little noise of a dog in there. Do you have a toy? Hi, Ella. Hi. How are you doing? Say, come on in. Look, at this is a beautiful come apartment. On in. Look how much taste you have. <laughs> I'm a designer, you know? Ella. Ella, you do, and she matches your house so perfectly. Do you like your new home? Do you like, I know, there's your dad. There's your, oh my God, she's in love with you. She says, I know. She Boy, hogs she the bed, is, but she's. She sleeps in bed with you? That's the way it's supposed to be. Does she freak out when you leave? Yeah, a little bit. So she sleeps in your bed. Is there any outdoor area or nothing? Yeah. Let me just see that, I want to see what she does. What a cute place you have. <laughs> Honestly, it's adorable. I'm really impressed. Oh, you can come back when it's finished. Okay. <laughs> I should probably get some tips from you. Uh, oh <laughs> wow! Like a barbecue we got a stuff, doggy so. paradise back here, Ella. Is this your is this your outdoor area? And what no, kind of never. exercise are you giving her? Um, I take her on about probably too many walks. I've been taking her on like six walks a day. But... I think that's good. Oh, Ella, you scored, sweetheart. You scored. Yes, you did. You, did you did. passed the test. You get to keep her. <laughs> You're a good owner. Are you, are you happy? Yeah. Ella's happy about it, too. You're a great dad. Okay. Awesome. Perfect. Very good. Another one saved. Now I gotta go get another one. Next time, Kristen Bell steps into her new backyard. Your backyard is complete. It's gorgeous. Maddie and Lucy take me shopping in Beverly Hills. I'm glad that I bought that spoon. That $29 was pretty quick. And I get a private hockey lesson. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> More designer to the stars. Check out we.tv.